Alan, we'll just start with um, the last couple of weeks. Obviously, a massive result at Leicester, but it's been pretty difficult since, hasn't it? Yeah, it has, and uh, as you say, puts it into, into context. And look, it, it was one that we, we spoke about it on <coughs> on Wednesday at, at the press day. That it, it has been a, a tough couple of weeks, and as we said, that our priority is to to look after Rob and his family. And Piers spoke a bit about playing for Rob for these last couple of games. I'm sure that's a massive motivation and, and also picking up where you left off at Leicester. No, it is. And I also alluded to the, the, the fact on, on Wednesday what a, how tight the, the players have been the, this year and, and Rob's been a big part of that. And as I say, I made no secret about it after the game in terms of Rob was captain and he, he found that he took it as a privilege and an honour to lead the Saints up at Walford Road in the... The, the lads responded in the in the fashion that they showed in that game, and, and they they played with desire and commitment, and we got the result we we worked so hard for. As is the situation, it's tough to move on, but we do move on to Wasps on Sunday. Two changes: Lufa obviously in for Rob, Alex Waller gets his first start since I think the end of last year against Newcastle. Good to have those guys back in contention. No, it is, and as you say, um, Luther came on within the the first few minute um, and, and put in a good performance last week. So, and then as you say. Uh, Alex Wally, he's, he's had a game for the, the Wanderers uh, away at Newcastle. He came off the bench last, last week against uh, Leicester, put in some massive scrums with, along with uh, Charlie Clare and um, Aaron Painter. So it, it, it's just rewarding. Um, not to say that Campisi Mafu has been, been excellent during, his, in, during uh, Alex's absence. So um, it's, just, it's one of those in terms of the, the, the strength of the squad. What are you expecting from Wasps? They've named a strong team, they're still battling away in those top four spots. We're, we're under no illusion. We, we talked about going to Leicester as being a challenge, and it's going to be no different this week going to Coventry. And we need to to kind of bottle that emotion and commitment, and um, the, being clinical as well. I thought that was, that was a positive uh, against Leicester, and we need to take that to Coventry on Sunday.